Kate Middleton and Prince William appear to be transforming the monarch after being described as Hollywood stars who exude confidence, according to a body language expert. Kate, Duchess of Cambridge and her husband, Prince William, will take part in the third and final garden party at Buckingham Palace on Wednesday. The couple will be joined by Princess Beatrice, Prince Edward, Sophie, Countess of Wessex, and the Duke and Duchess of Gloucester. They will meet some of the 8,000 guests on the Queen's behalf, the monarch having not attended any of the annual parties this year due to ongoing mobility issues. Kate and William have become increasingly more visible members of the royal family in recent months, also carrying out more celeb-like activities, like their attendance of the premiere of Top Gun, Maverick in Leicester Square last week. During the star-studded event, Kate and William mingled with Hollywood's Tom Cruise and Jennifer Connelly. Body language expert Darren Stanton has since analyzed the royal's appearance and has claimed the couple fit in perfectly with the stars. Speaking on behalf of Slingo, Mr. Stanton said, both Kate and William were dressed impeccably, William in a tuxedo and Kate in a black and white dress. From the way they conducted themselves on the red carpet if you did not know who they were you could quite easily believe they were Hollywood stars themselves as they exuded confidence and happiness at being front and center of the event. There was a really nice moment when Tom Cruise assisted Kate stepping up from the red carpet and took her hand, which she seemed to really enjoy and the actor was beaming throughout the whole interaction. Cruz reportedly loves the royals, and previously treated the Duke and Duchess to a screening of the Top Gun sequel. The actor invited the couple, having found out that William, a trained search and rescue pilot, was a huge fan of the original movie. While on the red carpet last week, Cruz said he and the Duke had a lot in common, and explained, We both love England, and we're both aviators, we both love flying. Top Gun's leading man also played an unexpected part in the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations. Cruz joined forces with Damien Lewis, Bridgerton star Joe Orlando and Alan Titchmarsh to take Britons on a gallop through history at the Royal Windsor Horse Show earlier this month. A total of 1,300 performers, 500 horses and a celeb-clad cast told stories of royal history in a theatrical, equestrian show. Speaking to ITV, the actor said, it's a real privilege. I was just very honored, when I was asked to be part of the Jubilee celebrations. She's, the Queen, just a woman that I greatly admire. I think she is someone who has tremendous dignity and I admire her devotion. What she has accomplished has been historic. He added, I love the history of England and I just have great respect for the Queen. So when they asked I instantly said yeah, it would be my honor. It's wonderful. Her Majesty's Jubilee celebrations will culminate in a special four-day weekend next week. Commencing on Thursday, June 2nd, the Royal Extravaganza will include the Queen's annual birthday parade, aka Trooping the Colour, a pop concert at Buckingham Palace and street parties across the nation. Both Kate and William reportedly get on well with the Queen and are expected to feature heavily in the upcoming Jubilee celebrations. Speaking about the Queen and the Bear, royal biographer Andrew Morton said Her Majesty has spent a lot of time supporting and nurturing the relationship. Mr. Morton said, The thing about Kate is the Queen was impressed she adored and loved William for himself, not for his title, William for himself.